guys, we're back in Minecraft story mode, and right now we're on episode four. So let's go talk to Petra. Hmm. Petra, um, how are you doing? Feeling any better? Are you feeling any better? Better is relative. If I just sit here and don't move or breathe, it's almost bearable. Man. If it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, you didn't know. What I heard about was getting that stupid oh, diamond. Pressed it the wrong one. Just know, I'm gonna do everything I can to make this right. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but you're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, you I'm need to rest up. up. You staying here is the right move. You'll never get better if we keep pushing you. I want to be there for you guys. I know you do. And you will. Maybe you're right. It's the right call, Jesse. I hope so. Okay, looks like Ruben isn't hey, buddy. doing too good. You doing okay? <laughs> of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Can I talk to Soren? Hmm. I said I needed some space, Jesse. Um, okay Actually, then. You said you needed time to think. So, did you think of anything? Not really. I'll let you know if I do. Okay then. It's backing up. So I'm gonna go see how Gabriel's doing. Gabriel's good. Uh, I'm not gonna group. lie, man. But we've pulled through worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? He's Agnes. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend, um, the next I'm being made fun of. That right there is Magnus. Everyone knows Magnus. Magnus? Hmm. And how do I know him exactly? I sense we have a uh, history. I Magnus like is your friend? Reminder. He's your friend. He's been your friend for a very long time. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember. Talk to him about your past. Something only you would know about. Like what? It's been so long since we've seen each other. Um, Eligard. Talk a little about Eligard. Eligard, yes. She was, uh, really something. Smart, funny, Amazing with redstone. Heck, she was the one person among us who didn't even need the, uh, the... Didn't need the what? You know, uh, never mind. Point is, you liked her. A lot. We all did. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. Um, it's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Eligard. Man, I don't even know where to begin. <laughs> Sorry, Reuben. I don't really feel like company. <laughs> Reuben! Ruben, come back. Not again. Ruben! Uh, 
Uh, yeah, that's better. Don't run off on me like that, okay? <laughs> you you understand <laughs> yeah I know you've run off before but things are different now we've lost too many people already and um, the world needs us needs us Ruben so much of it has already been reduced to bedrock and it's up to us to save the rest of it <laughs> Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig. But we have to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? Oh, just as you once helped us before. What's over there? It's about the future. There are three hmm. things now. You say that like it's my fault. It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for what, Soren? I did that by locking the command block away. So only you could use it. Oh, do you... Soren, you need to listen to me. <gasps> oh, what good has ever come of that? Um, stop could arguing. Stop arguing, please. Oh, no, this isn't an argument. It's me trying to make Ivor leave us alone. I told you, I wouldn't have followed you here without good reason. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> obviously! No, it's kind of I mean obvious. specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, what? I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. Oh, uh, You mean no. the Order's amulet? Yes, sorry. Gabriel that gave it to amulet. me. Did you also know I was the one he gave the amulet to? What? I... <laughs> I didn't know. It's going with the blue and red. Oh, with the blue I'm and the white. Fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well... Hmm... Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Withers gaze passed over them, and they went. We saw by. them pull it apart. We just saw a bunch of Endermen pull blocks off of a Wither storm. So, so enough of them working together might be able to destroy a Wither storm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least. In um, we need hundreds of them. Destroy a Wither storm? We'd need hundreds of them. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas. Hush, Ivor, for once. Huh. Question <laughs> is, how to bring the storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't. Um. We can use the amulet. Act, the Witherstorm will follow the amulet. So if we take the amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are. Yes. Yes, that's it. We'll lead them straight into a massive trap. If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block. Oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, really? when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan. <coughs> well, I said just in case he's here. And I'm um, inclined to agree. Uh, what's a failsafe? What kind of failsafe, exactly. An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon. And you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever. Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say uh... it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... 
Oh dear, what was that? You might not want to go into the cave. I can't believe it found us so quickly. We're not safe anywhere, are we? Well, we can't stand around and wait for um, it. Um, it's following yeah, us. There's a reason it's been following us. Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel- Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Hello, my name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. <laughs> he just I goes up to him. Hello. So we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can't. Um, I have are you sure? Yes, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three wither storms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm coming with you, man. Nice. Well, <laughs> I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. My friends are still out there somewhere. And you must do this for them. Okay, everyone, be careful. Guys, we need to go. Oh, I went press the wrong button again. Let's just hope they are. Hey, Jesse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The builder bump? You got yeah, it. the builder bump. Okay. I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. I'm pretty sure we're gonna meet them there. Clop, 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 clop. So then I guess we are going to Soren's. This should be fun. <laughs> Tell time. Okay. Ruben's just right on the back. <laughs> clop, clop, clop. <laughs> are we there yet? Almost there. I was gonna say, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? <laughs> can I say it again? I wanna say it like five times. See if I can get <laughs> any. Ruben just sitting there. It's pretty cool. Say it again. Can I please say it again? <laughs> he was leaving on her. He was leaving on him. <laughs> that was funny. Can I say we there yet again? I want to say it again. I think I might be able to say it. Oh, man. Oh, we've been falling asleep. Are we there yet? There yet. No, 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 we are not there yet. <laughs> I can't play any road games or something like that. And now probably Axel's probably just gonna beat us something. 
in a land far away. My rear end is profoundly sore. Huh. I feel like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Perlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. They sound cool, but let's just do this one. What exactly are the Far Lands? Are you being serious? The far lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? <laughs> oh, I'm too hungry to care. Yeah, I'm starving. We all are. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. We can't turn back what now. My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now. Not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs> I gotta find something for them. What's that? Swamp water. What's this? Potato? Take. Then I'll eat the other one. <laughs> Potato? You're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. And then, should I eat it? I'll just take it. Cause it could be a poisonous potato. And you'd never know until you eat it. Like they say, two potatoes is better than one. I <laughs> think they say that. You, at Jessie, least. Have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Ooh, but I see a cake. Cake. Cake cake. It's a witch cake. Witchy witchy witch cake. A witch's hut. Ah! We should mm -hmm. steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look. A cake. That's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Um. Very strong. Uh, random button in the middle. Here. Good idea. Uh, should have done the cake. <laughs> Guys, Jesse, did you find any food? Actually, yeah, some potatoes. But I'll have to wait. There's a witch nearby. We saw her creeping through the swamp and. <laughs> She's here! <laughs> oh no, you don't! Watch out for her potions! Uh, uh oh. Skeletons. Witches and skeletons? Team up. Really bad combination. You're right. Her potions combined with their arrows? Um, oh, we'll I'll distract killed. them. We need to distract them and get out of here. Fine, but how? The rest of you go. I'll hold them off. What? Ivor, no. There's no time to argue. Just head for the corner of the glitch wall. The what wall? Hey, you witch! You're not the only one who can throw a potion! 
Actually, I think it's potions of healing that can kill zombies and skeletons. That are regeneration, something like that, but. Got two potatoes, that should fill everyone up. Nice and full, right? Guys, I think we lost him for now. Wow. I see your wow and raise you up. Wow. Wow this and like whoa. The edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the far lands, my friend. Our lands are cool. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. Hey, at least Jesse found those potatoes. That might be the saddest sentence ever uttered. <coughs> well, do you want to get witch cake? Quite witch cake. Stretching skyward in all its glory. Did Ivor build wall. this? Did Ivor build this? No. Of course not. This is a natural phenomenon. The intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. How can I <laughs> live here? I mean, it's one thing to build a wool world inside the end, but this? Oh, I doubt he lives here. He most likely comes here only for his most secretive research. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. Oh, okay Feel then. About this if Axel and Petra were here. I know what you mean. Why is Axel Come looking trip all over Lucas? It's true. I guess we are going to we're going to Ivor's hideout place. Is this a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. Can if we just Ivor climb the walls? To build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. So, maybe we should not just wander into the world's hardest maze without a guide. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or I don't know. Um, let's explore. Edward of the Far Lands. We might as well keep going. <sighs> Here we go. Into another dungeon of doom. Okay then, maybe here and then there. Okay, there's Soren. Where'd Soren go? There he is. Over here. Whoa. Whoa. That is one of the coolest things I have ever seen. The far lands uh. may but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving. It's kind of, she just kind of like buzz killed that moment. Guys, looks like this is a Jesse! <laughs> dead end. There's too many. We can't fight them all. Everyone back. Let's see. Uh Climb. Guys, climb the vines. <laughs> Got to climb, climb, climb. We're climbing up the vines in the farlands. <laughs> well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, but now what? We're all separated. We're not Let's all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the paths connect. 
Sure hope they don't get lost in there. Well, they're gonna be on top. They don't get lost in there. So then, actually, what we're going to do is end the episode here. So I'll see you guys later. Bye!